Hey guys, what is up? And I welcome each and every one of you to a new episode of my Hearthstone like adventure. Actually, no, climbing adventures. In this one, we're actually sitting in master promos. This is going to be the first game to play, starting off with uh, some vain action because, man, I don't know. I'm just, I'm, again, I'm really feeling the champion right now. I, I don't see why I wouldn't play her if I'm feeling her. They look like they want to invade. But yeah, if you guys enjoy the video, make sure to hit that like button. Maybe for every for every like is an extra good luck for me. <laughs> No, but seriously, like the video if you guys enjoy it, and uh, let's get this party started, let's win, let's go. How is the bard level 2? Did he get experience that I know that's possible? Can I get the 4th auto on? Man, that didn't stun. Fuck, dude. It was like the, I mean, it doesn't matter. I push her to the thing anyways, and she has no flash. Like it doesn't really matter, but I can't believe that didn't stun. That's some next level bullshit. Yikes, this Lux. Yikes, dude. Oh. Let, let's push her in. Let's push her in. Can't die that really too well. Nice. I got assist for that too, baby. You're straight up food. Anyways. Fuck. I'm not gonna lie, I took a lot more damage than I expected. Oh, she ignited me, that's why I died. Okay. Kind of underestimated that, but Lux is just so squishy. She has literally nothing, so I thought that would go better, especially with the stun and especially with her missing her Q. So I am a little bit shocked that went as badly as it did. Oh, they're not. Wait, where the hell is the least in, first of all? Did I, wait, did I crit? Wait, what was that animation I just did? Vayne did like an animation where she jumped in the air and auto-attacked him. Wait, what the hell was that animation? I'm so confused. Yeah, my team is just doing so well. I, I, I literally coin flip this game hard. Like, uh, and Aurelia is absolutely shitting on Teemo, which I actually think Teemo is supposed to be pretty decent into Aurelia if he plays it well enough. Considering he's a one-trick, you expect him to. But he didn't. But every single lane lost. Oh, you're going? Oh, shit, okay. It... So there I went for the Lee Sin. I had a feeling that was going to happen because I tried to stealth right before I got into Vision. And then I had a feeling Lee Sin is going to try hovering around looking for something he just, you know, maybe he can help with something. Uh, and ended up just getting a nice kill. Dude. Man, that's the issue with being so mobile sometimes, man. And I mean, Talia is just broken, but like, man, it, being so mobile against a Talia like that, it just, it just feels bad, man. Like, you, you really just can't misposition, like, at all. Like, you'll just get caught out so hard. <laughs> Dude, it's so fucking broken. No fire to start with the R. The reason I start with my R is because I was hoping she won't notice and I can just invis at her out of nowhere and hit her really fast. Because I don't want to have to go through the through the issue of like trying to dodge her Q because it's like the angle is really awkward as you know I got hit. GG's! Hey, first game, nice. Got a better team, boys. Yeah. Alright guys, game number two is about to begin. We are 1-0 in master promos at the very moment for this one. Playing Vayne once again. I'm actually queuing bot right now because I haven't lost a game on Vayne yet, so I I don't want to fix what ain't broken, you know what I mean? This one might be hard though. Zyra Khan in lane, obviously, that's one of the most powerful lanes uh, if they play it well. That's number one. Number two, even out of lane, I'm going to have these two fuckers just gunning for me, man. Just just eyeballing me everywhere I go. So it's going to be a little bit of a rough one. But if we focus up, we have a decent team, decent CC. So I think we'll be fine. Uh, just have to play really, really well and really, really focused. So let's get this party started. Very nice, very nice. There we go. There we go. Zyra Conley, it don't matter. It don't matter when you have a good support. And this Thresh is a good Thresh. I can tell right away, he's a good Thresh. Man, the difference in support, I'm telling you, support is so important. People that don't think support deserves credit, 
It's literally what, what fucking wins lanes, straight up. Fuck, he has split focus there, it's not bad. Please get him. He has not flash. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna straight up counter this thing. I need level 6. Pussy! That was really good though, not bad at all. We got uh, a couple kills there. Jace ended up dying as well. Okay, okay. Nice little uh, assistance there to come back into this game. It's good. I like it. Evelyn's probably looking for a dive mid. Yeah, there she is. You see what I mean? I guess fucking. It's like there's. There's nothing I can do about that almost, unless. Other than just giving the tower. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Rakan with Zaya. Holy shit, the range is like. The range and how fast he can cover things is... I don't know. It's fucking stupid. Oh god, she actually fucking one-shots me. Literally one-shots me. My god, this is actually so fucking hard. Okay, I mean, there's one, there's a lead right there, a little bit, you know, he got the inhibitor, but, and then he got the Baron, looking rough, it is looking rough, but, man. Dude, Dick, what do you mean? Look at that, like, when you're, ch when she can do that to me and kill me still, that's, so, that's, okay, that's actually fucking bullshit, she literally missed everything. And she just ulted and I died. Like, what are you? Oh my god, that's actual bullshit. Alright guys, the next game is about to begin for this one. Playing Vayne once again. I'm like a Vayne one trick right now, boys. But it's just, I'm in promos and I'm feeling comfortable with it. I want to keep playing it. I actually am playing a couple games with this Yoki player over here. He is a support main, plays Leona Zillion. And uh, I feel like when you play bot lane, man, it's like, I don't know, dual queuing as a bot laner with the support. It just feels so much better. It really does. So hopefully this will work out for us. But let's go, boys. We're one and one in promos. Let's focus up. Let's win. Let's do it. Oh yeah, we can kill us, we can kill us, we can kill us. I've only got one bomb now. I've got exhaust. Oh, uh, we're, we're getting five man, we're getting five man. Oh my lordy lordy lord, we should just fucking kept farming bot I guess. Yeah, they're overstepping hard, oh, this is free. Yeah, super free, super free. Stay on Yas, stay on Yas. Uh, I've got speed up in five seconds. Okay. I'll, I'll just give it to you now. I reset. He's got wind wall soon. Remember. Let's go, baby. Okay, back to ball. There we go. Fuck. I have to use heal offensively. I kind of hate doing that, but whatever. It's not bad. Yeah. Okay. I can give you six. That'll give me six. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm, I'm throwing ulti on out on a uh, just in case. Nice. I've got exhaust. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I got this guy first. Yeah, yeah, you guys got him, you guys got him. She's exhausted. Alistair flashed up, Alistair flashed up. Oh, baby. Al Ali didn't die? I'm gonna be flashed away from him. <laughs> nice, Alistair flashed up. Fuck. His flash probably just literally came up right there. I think he was just waiting for it. Game is over. Why are they saying that? I don't have all for this, man. Alistair is always flashing on me, dude. I don't know. Ah, he's just fucking constantly flashing on me. I don't have ult anymore. Yeah, I, think we're just, I think we're chilling this one. Nice, we just got four kills for free. Uh, they might be looking at- Oh, they're doing Baron, they're doing Baron. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh god, I have nothing. Oh shit, you haven't backed. I have ult now? Got it. Oh, 
don't, I don't have all for Kha'Zix either. Come on, please kill him, PLEASE! No! My god, that fucking triumph! No, no, go, 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 we can go, we can go, right now. Oh no, they have okay, to we got to get your son off the barrel, or the, uh, Nexus. Dude, Yasuo Alistair, God, that, dude, that's so fucking hard. I've died so many times where the uh, Alistair just flash fucking WQs me and Yasuo ults, like... Alright guys, the next game is about to begin for this one. We're playing, what do you know? Vayne once again, boys. Vayne, Vayne, Vayne. Last two games were a little bit unfortunate, man. I, I, I took a little bit of a break. I was playing pretty poorly. I feel like I was starting to get a little bit tilted, so I took a break, reset. Back at it. We're one win, two losses in promo so far. So let's go ahead and just uh, focus up. I have a fiddle support. Honestly, you can't go wrong with the fiddle support. It's simple. It's strong. We have a brand mid. We have Ramus, Talon. Uh, uh, okay, this game has to be a win. We're facing Scar, by the way. Let's go. No, I'm not gonna lie. CSing with fiddlesticks feels really hard. His bats are super unpredictable. And the way they fly around, like it actually makes CSing really annoyingly hard. I don't know. Okay, nice, nice. They're, they actually played pretty aggressively there for no reason. Sona has no summoner. She used both summoners to kill me last... Uh, well, she used one to kill me, and then she used the other one to survive, just barely. Dude, you're, are you fucking kidding me right now? Dude, oh my god. Why? Why do we not wait? That engage by Fiddle was so random. Like, why can't he? Why did, I don't get why he wouldn't just wait for us to actually push in the wave. I gotta reset. Town's on his way though. Holy fucking shit, dude. I don't get this game. I actually don't understand what's going on right now. Oh, I actually left that? My god. Miracles happen apparently. I, I, oh my god, I hate this game. I cannot believe that her ultimate still went off there, dude. No fucking way. You're actually kidding me right now. Like, you're actually kidding me that her ult actually still went off there. Just please. Save the Baron, please. Save the Baron. Save the Baron. I, I, this game, ah, uh, nothing is going my way. Literally nothing is going my way. Oh my god, I could have cleaned that fight up so hard. I'm actually playing so bad. I think I'm actually still tilted from earlier. I'm actually playing really bad now. I, I could have easily cleaned that up, but... Is that GG? Who's alive? The Riven's alive. Holy shit, I'm actually getting hard fucking carried this game. Like, straight up hard carried. Man, this is- this game is- just feels like the life of an AD carry, I'll be honest, boys. Like, I don't know. It just feels like everyone is flashing for me and fucking me in the ass. And I'm just kinda like, please sir, 
Please be gentle. I'm just getting absolutely shut on by their whole team. They just flash for me every single time. Whether it's the Riven, whether it's the Sandra to press R, whether it's Sono to press R, I'm just getting flashed on over and over. All right, guys, and the final game of this episode is about to begin. For this one, we're going to see, uh, yeah, what happens. We're two and two in promos. Uh, this is it. This, this is for all the marbles, boys and girls. Do we get back to Masters and continue to climb the Challenger, or are we hard stuck Diamond 1? This is the game that will let us know. They have an Ash, which is interesting, with a Janna, though. Ash with Janna. I mean, it's a support when playing Ash, but even then, Ash with Janna. It can get pretty annoying late game because, uh, you know, Ash does scale fairly well and Janet with the shield will give her quite a bit of sustain. Not sus well, sustain too, but like just peel. Uh, and they have a Hecarim, which is also a little bit annoying now. This Hecarim just depends on if he, if he gets fed, then it's really, really bad. If he doesn't, he's really easy for me to deal with. So we'll just see what happens there. TF, of course, gold cards. So I'll probably have to go ahead and get a QSS after Rage Blade. But I'm going to, I want to, I want to focus and I want to play well. I'm, I'm not playing well right now, I feel like. I don't know why. I'm just not playing well. So I want to... I want to earn the Masters, you know? So I want to try to pop off this game, boys. Let's go. Dude, he pinged it. Why, man? He pinged the Hecarim is down here. Why are you still up there? Why can't you fucking reset? Alright, that bush is worth it. Don't need to heal him, good. I was hoping I wouldn't need to. Good thing I didn't. I'm just gonna go farm a bot. I have enough for Rage Blade now. This is really, really good. That was a good fucking pickup for me. Thank God I got the kill in the Hecarim there. That actually gave me a lot of gold that I needed. Now that I have my Rage Blade, I'm actually strong. Nice, yo, sick pickup. I don't do anything to this guy, bro. Okay, whatever. While well, these two are on me, they actually cleaned up the fight. Okay. Okay. Nice. While well, these two fuckers are on me, the team is actually making plays. Okay. All right. All right. Carry me, boys. Wait, do we actually win this game? Can I actually int this game this hard and still win to Masters? Holy shit, we actually won. I I actually I entered this game so hard again and I won. I guess that's gonna be the end of this episode. We got into Master Tier. I'm I'm like it's it's bittersweet, I'll be honest. I, I I'm happy I got into it, sure, but like fuck man, I I feel so undeserving. I, I really feel like I played the first promo game fine, but I just felt like I played almost worse and worse with each game. I just felt like I got more and more tilted with each game and the last game. I mean, the tank fucking Hecarim really did one-shot me, which was questionable, to say the least. But, I mean, at least when they were doing the Baron, I went in, I made some, you know, distractions, pretty big distractions, too. Hecarim and TF went on me, while the Echo just melted them. The Echo played super well. Fucking hard carry that game. God bless his soul. So, thank you for that, my friend. Appreciate it. Muchas gracias, my friend. Muchas gracias. But, yeah, the journey to Challenger apparently is not over yet, boys. It's still alive. We're sitting at Masters 0 LP. We still have some time, so let's see how far we get. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button. I think I want to go back to mid. Uh, with, as my primary, because, yeah, this, I don't know. I, I started, I was playing so well on Vayne, but maybe it's just today. Maybe I'm just tilted. I don't know what it is, but I feel like I'm just playing like an absolute buffoon right now. Like an absolute buffoon. Um, not happy with my performance at all, uh, especially compared to how I was playing with her literally the day before. So we'll see what happens next episode, boys and girls. But the Journey to Challenger is still alive. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Thank you for watching. If you did, make sure to hit the like button, and I'll see you for the next one.